overnight caught on the interstate. A driver lands in federal custody. A Border Patrol agent in Sumter County says the driver was smuggling illegal immigrants. News 6's Eric Sandoval is live in studio tonight. Eric, how did the agent track him down? Actually, you're not going to believe this. It was actually the suspension on the SUV. Uh, this car was traveling down I-75. The Border Patrol agent says he spotted it as it was coming down. When he ran the plates, they came back registered to a woman who was already deported to Mexico. And that's when the agent says he started following it. The Border Patrol agent says the SUV wound up parked here at the Florida National Cemetery near Bushnell. Inside the SUV, the agent says he found nine people. In the front, the driver, 26-year-old Jabbar Clauder. In the back, eight people in the United States illegally, seven from Mexico and one from Guatemala. They told the agent they'd enter the country in Laredo, Texas last week. Clauder told the agent a smuggler named Ray paid him $900 to drive them from Houston to Tampa. That was until they were caught in Sumter County. All of the people in the car, including Clauder, were arrested and taken to Border Patrol. And tonight we found out this was not the first time Clauder says he's done something like this. According to the report we got a hold of, he says just two weeks ago he transported more illegal immigrants, this time to the state of Maryland. Tonight he is out of jail. He has to pay $20,000, though, if he doesn't show up to his court dates in Ocala.